This is a quick personal review for the Asus Lake EP121. Now the first thing I'm going to mention is if you're looking to replace your iPad, look elsewhere. I've seen a lot of comments from people about how the iPad has a 10 hour battery life and this doesn't. Well compared to this product, an iPad is practically a toy. This is a computer tablet. It runs Windows 7. Now it's very slim, weighs about 3 pounds, it's very light, and it has a bright screen, beautiful colors, and it's just about the right size for the screen. I use Photoshop quite often, and I have more than enough room to work with. If you're a college student, or your job requires you to take notes, this tablet PC works great with one note. Now you will actually need to customize your handwriting. Okay, let me just do something real quick here. There you have it. Let me try an equation. There you have it as well. Now this also works well with MSN. The touch here works great. If you're planning on chatting quite often, I'll suggest you use the keyboard. Although I don't have any problems using the virtual keyboard, you won't be able to keep long conversations with someone. And honestly, I don't like to use the handwriting feature. So you have a virtual keyboard here and if you have used an iPhone before I'm sure you won't, you won't have any problems with it okay you can also use your handwriting it does come with a microphone and a webcam but the webcam uh, the quality isn't at its best actually let me just try Skype. Hello, welcome to Skype call testing service. After the beep, please record a message. Afterwards, your message will be played back to you. Okay, I'm making a review. Just testing the microphone on this thing. And while that's loading, I'm going to show you the video quality. Okay, I'm making a review. Just testing the microphone. Okay. And while that's loading, I'm going to show you the video. If you are able to hear your own voice, then you have configured Skype correctly. If you hear this message... Alright, well, the web browsing is smooth. I haven't experienced any lags. As you can see, also the speakers are quite loud, so you won't have any problems listening to music or watching a movie. Uh, the video playback is also good. I haven't experienced any problems with HD video. Uh, Netflix works great. Alright. Whoops. There is no lag 
on Netflix. And the quality is great. Um, just something real quick with uh, Firefox there's no lag here's basically loading here alright and well Firefox if you're using Firefox Firefox doesn't quite have it yet for the handwriting or the uh, virtual keyboard you would actually have to press quite a few times here in order to get that to pop out. Now well my only complaints for this product is the USB ports. The lower USB port is tough to work with. You will actually need superhuman strength to take this out. And I don't have problems with this because this is practically my uh, wireless keyboard so I, I don't plan on taking this out anytime soon. Now this one is not as tough as the other one but you have you know a few problems actually taking it out. Just taking it back in it's no problem. Uh, if I want to be real picky here the battery life is okay I mean I, I don't plan using it for more than four hours if you're actually planning using this for more than four hours I recommend you get the external battery to extend the life up to eight or ten hours well that's it for me now if you're a digital artist I do recommend this as a replacement for your 12 WX Cintiq or any other tablet that you have around I'll be uploading a video of me using Photoshop, Painter, and ZBrush. So check it out. Mm -hmm. See you later.